Now this is a me, son of a corporate and very parable. What well, is about him? Education on the street, so I'll include it with my. A lot of times my imagery isn't that uh, topical. Uh, I just reach and pull up. When I get some nice hot blonde disciples, near blonde disciples, uh, who can. Uh, yeah, it's that crutch of the amateurs of the street. They can hold up those posters of imagery I, I just designed of them. We'll, we'll do better with that. But uh, this is about when I lived six blocks east, tallest thing in L.A., downtown L.A. And I'm on my way back there. After work, yeah, where I had to work, Because you can't reach 424-229-414 row, can't reach a customer, don't know how many other customers you can't reach. And, um, yeah, don't know when else that lifeline. That's always where my main street fiction is. Well, let's get that part over with all military men worldwide on military bases, men and women. Pick up the phone on that military base, call John Melton Briggy, 424-229-414 Make a video of your hijack call to me. One and only. John Milton Brady from there. Use your phone, the military basis phone. And uh, make a simplified video of that phone not working. That hijacking of the, that call from the military base. Been asking for over seven years. Got here in uh, 2007 and... Got that first page go phone in November 2007. Been asking since then. For 93 checks. World Trade Center 93 checks for the dangerous religious, political, business, whatever other kind of censorship you can think of, of America's phones. And yeah, it always has. My mean parables like this, my imagery, my funny son of a copter married parables always end when you pick up that phone and see your family's lifeline not working. That's who you call, who you use to call the firemen, the police, paramedics. Make sure it works right now. And yeah, call from those military bases. Call, tell your family, your friends back home to call in front of the mayor, governor, whoever. Uh, reporters, of course, they're not doing their job. News anchors, officials, local, state to federal. Tell them to call John Melton Brady in front of them. Get the reaction for you, Semper Fi. DVDs of truth, your 93 check calls. That are hijacked. It's religious censorship. In America. So is this. You can't call me up, tell me what you believe. Document with uh, less than a $50 camera. $50 phone will do that. Cheaper one than that. You look for a good deal. Fifty dollar digital camera from Walmart. From uh, well, I hope Radio Stack Shack still carries them. They don't have EHDs, external hard drives anymore. But um, make those videos from those military bases. Tell your family and friends to make back home. Now back to my mean purple. I'm on the way back to six blocks east. And that's that uh, the room I lost when I. Uh, Went in the hospital. Last round of uh, sins of mankind, son of Carpenter and Mary, a wound in uh, June of 2014. I'm on my way back, and all of a sudden, this Humvee pulls up in front of me there, downtown LA. And it's got two big, tough guys in front, and John, the military street justice guy, is in the back. He rolls down that window, and he throws some candy I'm not one to pass up candy I grab as much of the candy as I can he throws and he points across the street and there's a car there and yeah it says uh, folks uh, wolves among the sheep hiding among folks doing good work very good work yeah to uh Cops and they're talking so loudly. 
that I can hear them all the way across the street. And one of them says, Oh man, I just thought I was making good money as a cop. You won't believe the easy money I'm making with that impersonator, the stone cold of mine. And they go on and on about this and that or the other. Uh, yeah, it's a parade. So the next day, uh, it's Stone Cold Main Street Fiction. The next day, they got uh, a couple of new guys in those uniforms. And they're part of the military pit bull project, Icebreaker Parade. Oh, going into high gear now. Across the country, all of you who have come to see the handsome ball guy, some Carpenter Marion, have been unable to see me. But maybe to uh, folks hiding behind authority, might have introduced you to some uh, this crowny little ball guy, or called him Stone Cold, or this or that, or the other. It's worth that second effort, that hundredth effort, to be a part of building that Christ complex, guys. Be in on the ground floor. Look for those folks who you saw misleading you. Huge industries here in California and yet yeah, worldwide that are now uh, part of that Melton Icebreaker Parade. Yes, for you in the military bases. Uh, in the military worldwide calling me up. And being misled by wolves among your sheep uh, kind of stuff. It's a simple concept. When you see someone other than me and my changing eyes, yeah, some carpenter marries changing eyes, same wounds put me in this wheelchair. Temporarily, I hope. Same uh, things going on with the eyes have been going on since '96, and uh, yeah, get some hot blondes here. They'll quick. They'll turn much quicker. The whole process will go on much better. But. Uh, you see those folks among your own. That's a simple concept. You see uh, attractive blonde girls next to that handsome ball guy. We start building. Till then, you look for that icebreaker parade. And I, oh man, it's been good here in uh, Stone Cold's. Uh, as far as the chemical uh, of the streets, uh, that kind of stuff. But uh, I just got back and, whew, hmm. That's not good. You can call it my street fiction. I'll tell you where it ends. 424-229-414. Pick up that phone call right now. And yeah, all military worldwide, this is an opportunity for you and yours. Walk through the wolves among you. Walk through the wolves among... Uh... Well, John's doing a good job of that lately. Hiding behind authority of all kinds. Walk through and uh, be a part. You got to see me in person to do that. You're calling from the military base for real, doing those 93 checks, World Trade Center 93 checks, seeing that military base's phones hijacked. Come see John Milton Brady, be a part of the building. And yeah, back to my story and my Main Street Fiction and stuff. The next day, they got someone new in those shoes wherever that uh, car is parked and... Uh, Oh, it's some mean stuff, so they maybe it's got some mean uh, chemicals or something. They're behind glass, the witnesses. And uh, Lou turns to Jerry and says, You can read lips. What's he saying? And Jerry said, Well, it's kind of hard to do uh, when they're upside down like that. Yeah, hanging by those balls of steel. Look for that Milton Icebreaker Parade, those who've been in the way of the icebreaker work can. Hanging by those balls of steel, simplify all the way. Millennium, uh, century at least, uh, decades for sure. Daily stuff for being in the way. Look for them and yeah. Come try again. Use that icebreaker. In Linwood now, they got tired of those uh, phones lighting up at the Burlington Convalescent Hospital and knowing what's going on on the other side. So come see me in person, wherever I'm at. I'm talking to Caleb down 
downtown LA independent living center hopefully something housing near a computer supposed to have internet here they don't have it and yeah I went to the library and uh, saw Lori there it's not a good place to go to the library so uh, come see me let's get started and uh, oh yeah back to that uh, Jerry says oh screaming something about that son of a bitch you know it's hard to read upside down and no I can't do that but they always get that wrong it's son of a carpenter and Mary come see me be a part of building Christ complexes and don't mind my mean street fixing guys girls especially uh, walk through hold me tight till that fixing ends and uh, till that uh, fictional screaming ends and be a part Come tell me what you think the Christ complex needs. Jesus is out here need. Got to do it in person. You have very real documentable censorship. Everybody on those military bases worldwide. All good cops and uh, any kind of authority figures. You make those simplify videos of that phone not working. Come see me in person. Let's get started.